Hi everyone and welcome to Cooking with Cricket. Except today it's going to be cooking with my son Alex. Uh, bringing him along. And he's going to make some steak fajitas on our Blackstone griddle. So here's my son and he's taking over. This is Alex. We're going to be making steak fajitas. This is the steak meat cut up. Uh, I just took a, a full flank steak that you could purchase and cut it up into strips season it with a little adobo and salt and pepper and we're going to be adding that straight to the blackstone we're going to take a little stir fry oil we're going to dab it on the corner over there just, just, just a little bit not much because this is seasoned oil I'm gonna take my this in real quick. Hold on, man. Okay. It's still the party. And then we're gonna add our onion and our bell pepper that we chopped up earlier. Drop a little oil. Go ahead and just drizzle those on in there. Let it cook until it's done, and we'll be right back when it's done. All right, it's been about two or three minutes. Just uh, take and stir for your meat, like so. And depending on how you like your steak, um, we have a pan and then we have a skillet in the oven at 450 degrees right now that we're going to take and pull it up and put it in the skillet so that way we serve it sizzling. An iron skillet. Yeah. That's the only type of skillet there is. No, there's more skillet. Uh, so you're going to want to let the vegetables caramelize on the outside about five to ten minutes or so depending on your heat. I like my vegetables to be good and golden brown. But, yeah, uh, we'll meet you inside. Here is his sides, his flour tortillas. I can't say that. Got some, um, Alex, what kind of rice is this? It's just uh, some Spanish rice that I cooked out of a pack. Sour cream, some pico to go. Oh, he's got some jalapenos chopped over there, some lime ow, juice. Ow, 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 ow. And there's the hot iron skillet he's about to pour them in. The fajita mix. Alright, we're going to take just a bit of stir fry oil. And just yoink a little bit on there. So we don't stick on the bottom too bad. Then we're going to take our fajita mix that we fried out on the blackstone. Take the steak first. And just pour the rest of it in there like so. And then we wanted to do it like they do it at the restaurant where they bring it to you sizzling. We're not done because we got a garnish that we're going to put on top. I cut up some tomatoes. And we're going to put some jalapenos in there. And there you have it. There's sizzling fajitas. You can just leave those on there hot and sizzling for everybody to eat. Well, thank you very much for purchasing and cooking supper. And uh, last but not least, while it's sizzling, just take you a little, just a little bit of some lime juice and just squirt it down in there. So if you enjoy my son cooking, and I know y'all like the taco soup that he did, and y'all ask if he could do some more videos, so here's him making his version of steak fajitas. If you enjoyed this video, please give him a thumbs up, comment, let him know. And until mine or his next video, we hope you enjoy. Bye, y'all.